Hey, hi, Greater Johnstown Elementary students and parents and community. Uh, Mr. Henry, Principal of Johnstown Elementary, just saying welcome back. Uh, we're going to be coming back here on September 8th. Uh, it will be the first day for students. We have some changes that have happened since uh, last year. I want to go through them with you right now in a short video presentation. Uh, number one thing is, yes, we're right now, as of uh, 8 19 <laughs> in the morning, we're asked to be wearing masks while we're in the building. Uh, that may change, like anything may change, but you know, just demonstrating wearing a mask, it can be, you know, your common mask you see a lot of people wear, it can be a neck gaiter, uh, it can be one of the uh, medical masks you see around, uh, but we're asking that um, you, you definitely bring a mask. And if you haven't got masks already, please make that part of the getting back to school supplies uh, for your child. Uh, prior to sending your child to school, if they're sick, please let them home. Keep them home if they're sick. Uh, please take a temperature check. We will not be taking a temperature check at school, so please take a temperature check before getting them uh, to the bus stop or getting them in the car to bring. We still be doing buses. We'll still be doing drop off in the uh, front of the building. Uh, students, please practice putting a mask on, spending a little time with your mask on during a day while you're still at home. Uh, again, practice makes perfect. And uh, the people that I've spoken to that have had masks on for a while, they've gotten used to it. So that's why we're asking you to please practice that. Um, as far as storing your mask in your body, you know, if you have one like this, you know, you, you can store it, you know, maybe on the side like this, or you can put it in your pocket. Uh, if you have a neck gaither, you know, you just sort of bring that down. Riding the bus, for a lot of you be riding the bus. Um, we're asking that you ride your bus. We're asking three rules, and those are your mask, of course, you got to wear a mask in a bus, your seat, you will be assigned a seat. Right now, we've assigned seats for all of you. And then ride your bus. We cannot have pe different people riding different buses in case there's contact tracing that we have to go back and see. So you need to ride the bus you're assigned to. You need to sit in the seat you're assigned to. And you need to make sure you wear, wear a mask, please. Hi, boys and girls. I'm Mrs. O'Neill. And I'm Mrs. Moore. And this is Vanna, our service dog for Johnstown Elementary School. We're going to show you what it's like when you get off your school bus and coming into the school. In the morning, you will get off your bus, you'll have your mask on, and you will walk through these doors. We will have your breakfast ready for you, and you will take your breakfast to your classroom and eat in your classroom in the morning. We will have a lot of adults here, lots of teachers that you know, that will help you get to your classroom so you know where to go. Students, I also wanted to show you our gymnasium. As you can see, we have put tables in here so that we can continue to be safe during our lunches. So we will have some of you eating in the gymnasium during your lunchtime. We're still gonna have a warm lunch for everybody. And also we are going to make sure that those students that have different allergies or dietary needs have those lunches as well. You will be sitting with the students in your homeroom and that way you can still enjoy socializing with your friends. Students, we have several touchless water fountains throughout the building, three to be exact, because you are going to be allowed to have water bottles this year. And as a district, we're gonna provide each student with their very own water bottle. These are really simple to use. Again, they're touchless, so you just have to stick your bottle of water right there, and they fill up with water. Hello, boys and girls. Welcome to one of our classrooms at Johnstown Elementary School. Look at all of our students here. Say hello, everyone. Hi. Hi. Notice that everyone is sitting six feet apart. Everybody also has their own school supplies in their own containers. So we won't share our crayons and pencils anymore. Everybody will have their own. Your special teachers will come work with you in your classroom and you'll stay here for most of your day. In the morning, you'll have breakfast here, but you will go to the cafeteria for lunch. Also, we have a lot of cleaning supplies that you will see around the school and in your classroom. We're going to use these cleaning supplies to keep you healthy and safe. Also, parents, you can look at our health and safety plan on our website so you can see all the work that we're doing to keep your children safe. Mrs. O'Neill. 
Can I take my mask off? No, you can't. Why? We have to keep our masks on all day so we stay nice, healthy, and safe. Thank you for asking. Students, throughout our school, we have automatic hand sanitizing stations, so you don't need to touch it at all, and you can wash your hands throughout the day. And also, our students are demonstrating social distancing while walking. So they are six feet apart, their masks are on, their masks are on properly. And they are following the signs that we have in our hallways. The green arrow indicates that means you go forward and that is where you walk. So we will always be six feet apart in the halls. Good job, students. Way to follow social distancing. Way to be safe. Good job, Vanna. Mr. Joe, would you please get on your side of the hall? Oh, why? Because you're not being safe. You're going to get close to other students. Oh, okay. Sorry. Thank you. Good job, guys. Okay, boys and girls, we also like to take you to the main office. Coming in the main office, you'll see a few changes. We have some plexiglass here. We also have some signs, and you're going to see these around the school to remind us to wear our masks and be six feet apart. We also have Miss Becky and Miss Sarah here too, familiar faces for you. Students, one of the things that we hope to do this year is to take advantage of our outdoor spaces at the elementary school. And we're sitting right now in our pollinator garden that we worked really hard to create for you this year. So hopefully we can bring some of our classrooms out here this year and other outdoor spaces of the school so that you can be outside learning in the fresh air. We want to end this video by saying that we know that you probably are a little nervous about coming to school. And this is new for all of us. We're all in this together. What we can tell you for sure is that you have adults here that care about you very much and that are gonna help you every step of the way. And we're gonna guide you along every step of the way. As you see, for example, my mask keeps falling down, so I need to keep pulling it up. We're gonna have these little things throughout the day that we're gonna have to remind each other about and tell each other about to keep, to keep our school and you safe so that we can have fun learning. And let's just remember, let's celebrate this time where we can finally be back together in our school. We look so forward to seeing you. We miss you and we think about you every single day. We'll see you soon. Bye.